Highlight, keeping you on top of all things tech. Welcome to Highlight. Today, I have a little PSA for you concerning keys for games. Now, we all like stuff that is, you know, at a discounted price. And one of the popular things that has been going around on the internet are basically sites that sell you keys for games. That is, of course, a key that lets you actually activate and play a copy of the game at a much cheaper price. As always, when something sounds too good to be true, chances are something is a little bit dodgy. Basically what's happening is, probably the guys who are actually selling you the codes for cheap are doing something that is either entirely illegal or shady in some way. What we're looking at today is basically a news article from GameInformer.com which covers the revocation of some keys from the game Far Cry 4. In this particular case, the guys who actually bought the original game keys and sold them away for cheap actually used some stolen credit cards. Since of course the charges were fraudulent, well, the keys were actually revoked by Ubisoft and what that means is, if you've bought a copy of the game from these guys, well, you can't play the game anymore because the key is actually invalid. What this means is the guys with the stolen credit card have basically made a bunch of money off you and run away with it and that left you with nothing. This is just one of the tactics used by these kind of cheap key stores. In the past, there have also been cases of stores actually basically buying a bunch of keys with their own credit card, reselling these keys online and then actually performing a credit card chargeback such that basically they get a refund for the keys. What this means is they've basically not spent a single cent and once again, well, a bunch of people paid them money for keys that now don't work. So that is your PSA. Be very careful to only get games from, you know, well-known retailers. Any site that actually offers you game keys at a cheap price should be treated with some amount of suspicion. Anyway, that's it for today's episode of Highlights. If you want to read the original article from GameInformer.com, do head down to the video description for an article link.